A very good morning to you and welcome back to the shade then we're not outside today so no worries of rain and people and wind <laughs> but what a location that was it's a lovely place to visit uh let, let alone have the honor of uh, shaving there um a few people thought i was mad but uh, that's part of it you see so <laughs> no i am probably right um part of the shave i'm going back as you'll see by the thumbnail, uh, a th product I used to use a lot when I started uh, shaving, apart from palm olive, that was one of the first soaps I used, but um, Arco was a brand I used a lot of. The creams and that, these came later, it was more the soap then, the, you know, the, the standard soap. So I'm going to use the, this is called the uh, Comfort uh, Shaving Cream by Arco, it's a nice, nice scent. Um, I'm using a, a new razor on loan to me, and this is it here. Make sure I get this right. So it's the um, Blackland Blackbird stainless steel three piece open comb, and it's an 85 millimeter. Um, wow, good weight to it. This is on loan from Chris. Thank you, Chris also known as uh, CB Shaves on YouTube. Oh, it's a nice little uh, neat thing where the thread is, see that sort of edge, ledge fits inside there. That's a nice idea. Okay, that's what it looks like. Is this gonna be aggressive? Well, I'm not sure. So, I'm gonna go with a Persona Red, which is our number two, so this is its third use. We'll try that. I don't want to go, go with a feather. <laughs> so many thanks, Chris. He's loaned me, uh, I think it's about three razors a while ago now, and I've loaned him a few things. So, uh, sorry I'm late getting to use them, but... Uh, so many things to, to try and you know that's lovely oh it's a very slight overhang to be aware of there if you can see the blade exposure give you an idea if you can see it you see oh i don't know it might be there was a good gap good gap for the head and the and the open comb the combs there lather tunnels there we go so that's that's what it says in the box there and inside Blackland and there's some I'm not gonna use them Chris so don't worry <laughs> what's that so very nice okay quite a large knotted brush this is a synthetic tuxedo the dice is it magic dice or something magic dice yaki brush 26 millimeter so because I'm using quite a large knot, I'm going to use the fine bowl because it's a wider base. So we'll put some of this in. You know, these are just sort of, these Arco creams, they work well. Um, they've got different scents. The cool action is my favourite. Um, there's a mint one I've got. Uh, there's a gold one, which is based on the Pacaraban Million, I think. There's a few scents, but um, these are quite standard and uh, quite nice. So we'll have that up. You having a shave today? What's the shave of the day? And I forgot to tell you Sunday, the Sunday dinner. I'm too excited in the rain, you see. That, um, there we go, so it's wet, but it's not dripping. Quite a large knot. Um, that area of Snowdonia, Llyn Padan in Llanberis, very, very famous place for photographers. They go to take a photo of that lonely tree. And I think you, Don, conversational shaver, you asked, how long has it been there? Well, look at the size of it, not that long, I'd say about 20 odd years. But I'm not sure, to be honest. But it doesn't mind being surrounded by water. 
because it does go up and down you know it's a yeah it's a nice this is a what i class as a very clean fresh scented soapy scent <laughs> and straight away there's no messing good old arco and i came across this through steve farragher through his videos and um M many of you know him from years ago. He's still got his channel. He commented on Paul's wet it's not so long back. It was nice to hear from him. Uh, busy man. And uh, he used to visit Turkey and bring back the Arco and stuff like that. So, And there was a Turkish shop in Liverpool, in Kensington. The L7 market. I don't know if they still sell stuff. But that's where I used to get Arco stuff from. So just wet the face. This is still doing okay so far. Well, that is hot. That's what you want. So halfway through, are you having a good week? I hope so. Okay. Here we go, let's slather this up. Look at that, beautiful. Good stuff if you want an easy shave. Quick shave maybe, or a holiday shave. Not messing. I'll go over the beard. Yeah, it's easier to see it. Yeah. Oh. Spilling most of it. So, uh, I'm not sure if this is an aggressive razor, but uh, I know the blade, so we'll see. Very nicely made, I must say. Very nicely made. So I'll heat it up. The Blackland Blackbird. There we go. There we go. Three piece open comb, first pass, first use, and the persona red, third use. Here we go. Forget how nice this cream is. Lots of whiskers there. I'll tell you what the aggression is in a minute. I think it's got a bite to it, but. Nothing major, but no future sort of a false bottom aggression, but it's, um, you can feel it. In a nice way. But we'll, we'll tell on the second pass, I think. It's nice. Okay. Oh, look already. <laughs> Unless I've gone over that. Oh, I'm not sure. Hey, that's a good idea. If you've got a bit of a goatee, just take it out of that for the second part. Nice, nice. All right, come on. Stop looking at that. So how is your week going? Hope your shaves are going well and you, if you're working, I hope your working week is going well and your good health.
Yeah. Yeah, I keep saying this, but the weeks are just flying by. Whew. Flying by. Keeps nice and clean, this. Which it would do, I rinse it regular. Nice weight, lined. There's lined sort of knurling on it. Nicely made, I class it as a short, um, between short and a medium length, but uh, really nice cross the growth. I'll be able to tell now it's more accurate on the aggression. Very, very comfortable. That's a nice blade, that. Good audio feedback. Not too loud. Very nicely made, I must say. Feels very precise if you own one. That is nice. So I'd say in this shave now with the blade I've got, um, it feels. Is it a good idea? <laughs> um, very very slick cream, by the way. Very very slick. Never had a problem with Arco, no matter what the scent, even the soap. If you lather it right. Um, the aggression, I'd say for me in this shave using this blade is low end aggressive um very comfortable and then he started shaving then come on get it I tell you, I went to a house. How was it? Forgot to tell you, a couple of weeks ago, two or three weeks ago. And um, chap there, nice chap, nice family. And he was. <laughs> he had a electric, like a battery razor shaving. He was on the phone here. Trying to shave, and he had a <laughs> and a piece of toast in his mouth when he answered the door. Anyway, he must have you know he must have been sort of doing this and eating as he was talking. But <laughs> talk about multi task. He must have been late or something. I, don't know. I couldn't do with that. One job at a time. Yeah, phone. Trying to shave, and a piece of toast. <laughs> right against the growth. Blackland Blackbird. Three piece. Open comb. Non adjustable. And it feels beautiful. But this blade works, you see, for me. In well, most razors, every razor I use, really. Aggressive, mild, medium. Well, I think that's the beauty of buying multi 
branded, multi-branded uh, razor blade sample packs. So you can pick through and you haven't spent a lot of money, pick the ones that work and then obviously buy more of them. But it takes time to find really the blades that work in honesty because you have to try them and then try them if you know if you may have four razors you might have 14 razors you might have 400 razors but you know what i mean you have to try those blades each one might work differently in different razors it's very sounds very complex but once you start using different brands of blade in different razors and you'll have your favorite razor and you know you'll know what works with what in the end but it does take a bit of time but it's worth the effort See if we can uh, save wasting. Yeah, look at this. They have started a new trend. It keeps the. <laughs> it's easy. Oh, look at this! I'm doing it wrong. Um, it keeps the soap or the cream in your beard, and it's ready then to scrape out for you. Well, if you do pick up some on each pass. Save the waste. There you go, that'll do. All right, three, two, one, pick up time, baby. Look at the state of this. I've seen babies eating with less mess. I don't know. I, somebody did say in the comments I had to go into work last week because I didn't have my neck brace. So for those that love it, I'll do it again. I won't be at work today. Why not? Because I've done my neck. <laughs> he should know, shouldn't he? Why not? you done my neck in. I've done my neck in. Right. Thank you. These pickups are getting higher and higher. <laughs> A very nice razor, feels very nice. Low end aggressive, put a feather in this. High end aggressive, <laughs> maybe. You surprised sometimes. Nice light touch. That is nice. Wow. Okay, cold water rinse. I tell you, it's quite warm in here. <laughs> it's been very mild lately. Very mild. Weather wise. But aggressive, razor wise. Absolutely beautiful. Ah. How's this looking? Yes, happy with that. I have a look at it in more detail sometimes after the shave and make sure it's you know just right and it seems okay. All right, so we're using Humphreys Citrus Witch Hazel. Can't beat a bit of citronic. Yeah. Oh, I sorted that um, weeper. 
very comfortable razor that good weight to it um that's a, it's aggressive but a, a low end aggressive for me with that blade um really comfortable nice to hold move movability is nice very maneuverable now this might hurt arco comfort cologne Oh no, oh that's nice that is. Oh, I just wish they'd last longer, they don't last really good. What do you think? <laughs> One day we'll be doing that. One day. Yeah, don't know how but... And then we're going to go with the uh, aftershave cream. This is a new version I think. That is nice. The cream is not as thick as Arco Classic, but you've got to work it in, work it in. Good winter one, that. Why well, I'm looking there, it's not there, but that's what I usually keep it, isn't it? Um, that's lovely. Okay. So we've used the Blackland Blackbird Stainless Steel three piece open comb, non adjustable, uh, beautiful razor. Nice to look at, feels good, and it works well. Thank you, Chris. I look after it, it'll be clean when you get it back. We've used the Yaki 26mm Lucky Dice or whatever synthetic tuxedo knot. Quite a large knotted brush, but um, nice. The fine uh, porcelain lather ball. We've used Arco Comfort Shave Cream. Lovely. Uh, when you add that cologne to it, it's beautiful. It really brings the scent out. A very clean, fresh fragrance. Yeah, very nice. We've used the aftershave balm. Not doing this in any order, have you noticed that? And the uh, Humphreys Citrus Witch Hazel. Really nice. Uh, oh, and Welsh Water. Thank you, Paul, for the Welsh Water and colleagues. So thanks for watching. Really happy with that. Close, smooth shave. Um, and that's it. So I'll see you on Sunday. That'll soon come round. Uh, it's always good when it does because you can have another shave. Uh, so thanks for your company. Thanks for your chat. And I'll see you on Sunday. Have a great week. Take care. And bye-bye.